प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू यू आई पाथ एक्सपो हब चैनल एंड हिट द बेल आईकॉन बी द फर्स्ट पर्सन टू वॉच द लेटेस्ट ऑटोमेशन हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो ऑफ यू आई पाथ वीवी डॉट नेट हाउ टू गेट फर्स्ट नेम और लास्ट नेम फ्रॉम अ फुल नेम ओके वी विल सी दैट हाउ डू यू गेट द फर्स्ट नेम और द लास्ट नेम और यू वॉन्ट टू कन्वर्ट इन एनी द फॉर्मैट हाउ डू यू डू डू दैट इन यू आई पाथ baby dot net let's see this so as a input this is i am taking a name as an example okay so with this name i want only i want the first name so how do i write it so i think if you have gone through the ui path baby dot net tutorial that we have on our channel uh, i think you should be knowing this answer but again for anyone who would like to know it you are welcome so let's get started so here what i am doing input variable contains the full name right so what i am going to do so there are multiple ways you can do it but this is one of the way i am going to teach you which is simple what i have to do input variable right which contains the full name i will dot and i am going to split it okay and when when you split it what would happen the bab the entire name is going to split into three different parts babra h and john right so out of that i want the first name so first name means i will simply write zero so what i am going to do split in the bracket put double quotes and ensure there is a space why i am giving a space because within that name there is there are space right babra space h space so space is the uh, delimiter which is going to define how you want to split it so, and putting c as character and here i want the zero index so zero will contain this index will contain the first name right so this is one way i am going to also show you how do you let's say sometimes you have that right you want last name and then first name middle name like that also first name comma then you have your so you can write in very different different formats i am going to show you that so let's test this and see and then i am going to teach you that so here what happened here i have to put the let's say output variable done once i do do this let me put a message box and simply say output variable okay if i do this and try to run it the output should come as the first name babra so let's see that okay i got it now i want to convert in a very different format i want the last name at the beginning comma then give a space then babra h so if i have to write in a different format so how do i do it so for that again you can tweak this code so what i want the very first thing i want is the last name so the last name will be in the second index right and here give a plus sign and in double quotes i want a comma and space done i have given that then give a plus sign here i want the first name right so i will say input variable i think most of you must have got this answer by now so split and here in the bracket again the same piece of code i am going to repeat give a space write c and here you have to write the first name so the first name starts in index number 0 okay so last name will come first comma space and then the first name and after that you want a space right so give a plus sign double quotes give a hit on the space bar and here plus again the same thing i want to repeat but this time the index number will be 1 so i'm writing split and then in bracket i'll put double quotes give a space c and here i'm going to write 1 okay so that way if you see the entire thing is going to convert the entire name into a very different way so let's run it and you will see the output so it should say john then comma space babra h do you see this so these are the different kind of tweaks you can do if you know how to play with the vivi.net code that's why it is very important for you to go through all the vivi.net playlist that i have created in our channel ui path expo hub please do go through them and i am sure you will learn lot of things and this this one must have helped you on how to get the first name or last name from the full name thank you very much for watching this thank you for joining us thank you have a wonderful day guys